The term AI, artificial intelligence, was coined at a conference in Dartmouth in 1956. But even before that, the concept of computer intelligence had been around. In 1950, Alan Turing, a famous mathematician and who is known generally as the father of computer science, also the subject of a great movie called The Imitation Game, um, came up with what we call the Turing test, and it, which in its simplest terms is the ma machine's ability to exhibit intelligent behavior indistinguishable from a human. In other words, a human judge would not be able to tell the difference in a conversation between a machine and a person. And I'm pretty sure we're past this point and, and it's really only accelerating. Anyway, artificial intelligence kind of hung around in theory and academic circles um, in what's known as the AI winter until the 90s when computing power was greater and IBM developed Deep Blue, showing AI's capabilities to the world when it beat world, champ world chess champion Gary Kasparov. IBM kept developing their AI until about 2011, Watson was able to win Jeopardy, proving capable of natural language, understanding natural language. Then 2011 was kind of the tipping point in AI where we started seeing all of these AI assistants coming online, like Siri and Alexa. Computing power was starting to hit a sweet spot where we could start using these, these AI assistants in our pockets. Although in this image I'm fast forwarding to 2022, there were some huge advancements in AI algorithms in the 20 teens that, that get us to 2022. Around a year ago to this day when OpenAI released Chad GPT to, this world, to the world. I think before this, the fastest app to reach 100 million users was TikTok, and that took nine months. Chad GPT reached this milestone in only two months. Because of the success of Chad GPT's other competitors, have started to flood the market. Um, Google Bard released Google released Bard earlier this year, um, and there's also specific services for AI, such as image services like Midjourney and Dolly. Microsoft invested 13 billion in OpenAI, which is ChatGPT's parent company, infusing it to almost every product they own with with Microsoft Copilot, including the Edge browser with its new Copilot feature. <clears throat> 